Hello everyone, David from goldstartool.com and we're gonna do a uh, uh, video on the console 255RB-3. This is a walking fish, walking fish, walking fish sewing machine, uh, very heavy duty. You know, with the, the 206RB-5 that is very popular and then the, this is the next step up and I tell you why. 255RB is a drop bobbin, not a side load. Usually you have the bobbin load from here, okay? Or let's say from here, but you see here, there is nothing. It loads from here. This is the bobbin where it goes. And it's a extra large bobbin, not the M bobbin. This one does not take M bobbin, this machine. Um, 255RB-3, up, here. From here is a drop bobbin from the top, another side load. Uh, I talked to the owners of the company, I wanted to know what are the, besides this being a large capacity over M bobbin, what would be the other, um, they said, people said that this is more heavy duty. And it was much easier to load the bobbin here. Uh, what I have is a 138 uh, nylon bonded thread, both on the bobbin and on the needle. And here we go. You got reverse, you got from one to 10. And um, if you watch any of my videos, all the tables and the legs are the same size. 48 by 20, this is a T, this is a K leg. The motor that we're using today is the regular servo motor from console. This machine could be needle positioned, meaning you could have the needle up or down. And uh, No problem. This is only a guide right here, by the way. You could open this up. Right, and adjust it for, or just take it out. I'm not using it, I don't want it, I don't need it. But here. 135 by 17 needle. Starting at 21, 22, 23, 24, no problem. Uh, no oil pump. You just put where you see this red spot, you put some oil. Uh, timing belt right here. V belt, bobbin winder, thread stand. The same type of, uh, and it has the sa uh, safety stitch, by the way with safety stitch, or uh, sa I'm sorry, safety clutch. So if it's a too heavy of a product, you saw all, all the sudden will lock. You could press this and you unlock it. Um, again, this is the needle adjustment from here. Uh, what else? Amount of oil, you could put oil in here. Very, very good machine, it's really nice. We don't sell a lot of this machine, to be honest with you, over we got two or six hours more. But it seems like uh, if you wanna go uh, really heavy, people like this machine. Uh, again, reverse, a stitching from one to 10. And what I'm gonna do today is, while I have this machine, I have three of these are going out, I'll have this one out. This is also 1508. I have done 1508 on this one. So 1508 NH. Let's say this is a super heavy duty for 206 RB. Higher model. This is the top of the line, 1508. This is the jumbo jet, right? Um, I told him to plug it in. Did they plug it in? They don't plug it in. Don't worry about it. Plug it in, plug it in. All right. 
I told somebody to play this. So this one also has a super size bobbin. What are you showing? Also, 1508 NH is also top load, right? With a extra large bobbin. Uh, other reverse, this one goes all the way to not a 10 also. And same thing here, you see this way? Look at here, nothing. This one also safety clutch, very heavy duty. The difference is between these two if you want to compare 255RB-5 and with 1508 NH, automatic bobbin winder here. That one has a side bobbin. On this one, I use 138 uh, thread. On this one, I'm using a T60, which is not a big deal. One more thing. This one, I'm going to take the Take it out, put it back in there. The reason I'm telling you is because with this one also, you don't have oil pump. They call it dry head. Instead of that one, you just drop oil in the, where the red spot is. This one, you just go ahead and pull this up and put the whole oil right in there, right? So I'm gonna show a little bit. You sound, you heard the noise on the other one. The same, same thing, same. You could use the same motor. On this one, we have a brushless servo motor. So you could add a needle position too. But um, really doesn't matter which one. Same table, same size, same, same everything. Um, and I, I've done a video on this one too. And How are you, Jazz? Good, sir. Thank you. Good. Just that. On. Yes. So this. This is with a very light, not light, this is a T60, T105. T105 thread, that one is T138 nylon thread. Bonded. But yes, bonded. Look at this. That machine would do the same thing too. That machine would do the same thing. They have accessories inside. Again, both needles are 135 by 17. Uh, just some accessories, some covers. What else do you need to know? You could order T legs with this machine. Great, 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 great sewing machine. Uh, I love them both. Let me just try something while I'm here. We told people you could do this. Oh, people want to know probably the uh, measurement. Uh, I would say half an inch. Same thing with the other one but you could think that that one goes higher. With this one, let me just, while we are. This is the max and a little bit less than half, right? A little bit less than half. But, uh, Sure. Let's see. 
I just don't want to break the needle and... What I told you. Look at that. Mr. Council, you should be very happy. Look at this. Wow, unbelievable. So this is for people that really want to do and do webbing and they want to do card box. Woo! Nice, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Right, done. See, this is how much should I, should I show him the back? Back stitch, obviously the back was white. And this is from the front, this is nothing. If you could see, these are the stitch, the white ones. Great stitch, this is front. And this one. Yeah. This one is more than half an inch. Yeah. Almost three quarter. So triple feet. Feet dog moves. The outside feet moves. Inside feet moves and the needles moves. Okay? We have all different type of feet for this machine. Both have the same type of feet, by the way. But we have tons and tons and tons of feet. Walking food, left, right, zipper food, um, cording food, whatever type of food. Uh, anything else? I covered everything. All right. Thank you so much for watching this. Walking. Thank you so much for watching. This is David from Gold Star Tools. And have a golden day. Thank you.